Living in harmony with nature is really the most fundamental principle of Ayurveda. We can say that where there's harmony, there's health. Where there's disharmony, there is disease. My name is Amish Shah, and in many ways, I'm your average 35-year-old American-born Indian living with my family in California. I spent my childhood years growing up in New Jersey, chasing the American dream. As I got older, I realized I was passionate about business and technology. And at 25 years old, I made my first million dollars in my business. You can imagine as a 25-year-old making a million dollars, how that feels. What, what are you going to do? What I did was, I partied. I'm sorry to say most of Western society is not in the flow with nature. In Western society, we're very driven. We're always pushing. The kind of information processing that we get and the pressure to multitask and the electromagnetic stress that we're getting has never been experienced by the human race on Earth. I noticed things that were starting to happen, patches of dry skin on my body, bleeding when I was going to the bathroom, my mind was all over the place, stuffy nose, 24 hours a day, not being able to sleep. I didn't know where this stuff was coming from. Disease just seems to pop up. We just keep getting sicker, younger, and people aren't linking it to anything that they're actually doing. We now have an entire population who cannot figure out why they are sick. Why do we have an epidemic of cancer? Why do we have an epidemic of obesity? We have to have an approach that really addresses the underlying causes of disease. Ayurveda teaches us that nothing is right for everyone. Everything is right for someone, and Ayurveda is the path of understanding what's right for you. So I decided to go to India and go all in, take that leap of faith and learn more about Ayurveda to really connect the dots and help heal myself. What's fascinating is that 5,000 years ago, the ancients from India had cataloged over 9,000 plants and herbs that are known to have medicinal properties. There are now over 25,000 effective plant-based formulations that are used in this traditional folk medicine, and more than 1.5 million practitioners are using the traditional medical system for healthcare in India and worldwide. The word Ayurved is a Sanskrit word. Ayu means life and Veda means knowledge. The ancient teachers taught us, use food first to heal the body. When foods don't work, then use the herbs. There's a, a lovely saying in Ayurveda that says, Roga Sarvepi Mandagna, which means the root cause of all disorders lies in poor digestion. We're at a time where some very ancient knowledge is starting to meet some extremely exciting modern technology. So this, this is my perfect time. This is a time of dialogue. This is a time of revolution. It's a time of evolution. It's a time of questioning. It's a time of new answers. It's a time where things are coming together that we have never seen come together in recorded history.